Hey guys, so I'm just gonna film a little get ready with me kind of video. I don't really know, I just wanted to film. Um, I never film because I'm useless and whether I actually get around to editing it and uploading it is a different story. I do have the day off uni tomorrow, <sighs> thank god, and then it is the weekend. So, I have no excuse. I've got reading the week this week at uni, which for everyone else means that they get a week off of no lectures. For me, it means, well, I have no lectures, but still have nine hours of labs and an exam. But uh, I'm gonna start with my primers. I'm gonna go in with the YSL. I'm not reading it, can't read it, live with it. It's the one with the gold flakes in and the Elemis Pure Rate. Pro Radiance, Illuminating Flash Bulb. Where did I get Pure from? I don't know. But anyway, so this is... <laughs> this one's just gonna go in the center of my face and then I'm gonna put this around the outside of my face. I don't actually remember what I'm doing. Sorry, I've just woken up from a nap and my mind is just going blank, so it's probably gonna take me about three hours to make this video. <laughs> but I'm gonna go in with the YSL Founder, It Will Hours Foundation. And I did wet my beauty blender this time because I'm on it. To be fair, I've probably already filmed about three videos that I could edit and upload. But I don't know where they are on my phone. Or if they're still on there. So I'm just dotting this around my face. And just blend it out in like circular motions. Yeah, I did try to film this video earlier, just before my exam, but it was just too hot in my room and it wasn't going well. And all my makeup was just melting off, so I gave up and so I just went and had a nap because revising for my exam obviously wasn't on my priorities. <laughs> no, I'm joking. I just don't like to revise before an exam just because it stresses me out and it's too late to learn anything anyway. I can't. I can't cram, so I was like, just gonna, so I just like to chill out. Now I'm gonna go in with the Bella Pierre Dark Circle Illuminator. It's just a little concealer and a little pop, and there's not much more to say about it really. It's a concealer and a pop, and it, I like it actually. It came in a set that I got in TK Maxx actually, and it had the concealer, a cream contour, a green color corrector, and a little setting powder. But I think it was something like £13 when it's normally like 40 So obviously I was like, <laughs> yes. Anyway, I'm gonna go just blend that out so I can listen to some music. Ha, I got everything organized before I started filming. Because I have my life together. I do not have my life together. At all, in any way. I cannot say that. Under my eyes and on the highlighted areas, except for above my lip. I'm going to be applying the e.l.f. under eye setting powder. The reason I don't put it on my lip is because if I sweat at any point of the day it comes out and I might end up with like a white, <laughs> I just end up with like white powder just above my lip and then I'll set the rest of my face with Bare Minerals Mineral Veil. I did try the banana setting powder from Bella Pierre but it's very banana. <laughs> and then I'm just going to go in with like a little kabuki brush with the mineral veil. This isn't my best foundation I've ever done, but we'll live with it. So I'm actually just gonna put a bit of that to kind of down my face. Down my face? Down my neck. Just cause it helps it blend in a little bit better I find. And then I'm gonna go in and do my brows with the MYX Tame and Frame Tinted Brow Pomade in Brunette. Brush, 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 brush. So I'm just gonna go in with a little brow brush. Do I still have? Oh, I do. I glued two little gems behind my ear because when I was well a few years ago when I was in my emo phase, I really wanted a piercing there like that, and so I stuck them there before my exam. I just completely forgot about them. Now I'm gonna go in with the NYX eyeshadow base in, is this white or pearl white? I don't remember. In white. And then I'm gonna set it 
This stuff creases really quickly, so I'm gonna set it straight away with the under eye setting powder. I'm gonna go in with the Morphe 35M, which looks like this one. So this is one that's just matte, so I'm gonna add some shimmers in too. But yeah, I think this idea should work out really well. Usually when I say that, it doesn't. So I'm just going in with the Morphe Y15, and I'm gonna go in with this top color here, just, just to down a little face. So it's not quite as white. Just a little transition shape, that's the one. That's the word I was thinking of looking for. So now I'm gonna go in with this color here. Here-ish. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna go there -ish. So next, I'm just gonna go in with this color here. Right in the outer crease. I want to turn this into a cut crease. So I'm going to go back in with the eyeshadow base. So now I've half cut my crease, I'm going to go back in with that brown colour and then I'm going to go in right in the corner with a dark brown colour. So now I'm just going to go in with my Androgony palette and I'm actually going in with the colour Frosting. I just put my thumb in the Dominatrix. Great. Oh, great. But I'm just going to go back in with this brush and clean it off in a little flannel that I keep on my leg. And I'm just going to wet it with a bit of all nighter. So I went in with Crocodile Tears for my eyeliner liner, and then I outlined it with the Burberry. So I've just put some brown in my waterline and put a bit of more frosting underneath my brow bone. And now I'm going to go on to my Morphe uh, 9BZ palette and I'm going to go in with this colour <laughs> and I'm just gonna bronze up my face. So now that I've bronzed up my face a little bit, I'm gonna go in with this Dior blush in oh, I'm gonna take the brush out I'm looking for it, in the shade Strawberry Sorbet. For my highlight I'm going in with the Jeffree Star Summer Chrome Collection in Summer I forgot what it's called then, Summer Snow Cone. And I'm gonna use a Morphe Y13 and I'm just gonna wet it a little bit. So I just went and did my lipstick off camera because you won't be able to see it anyway because I lean right into <laughs> to my mirror. So I just used the colour Flamethrower by Jeffree Star. So I just went and applied some mascara and lashes and they're not really sticking because I can find my normal eyelash glue and this one is really shit. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe, it really helps, and if you'd like to leave any comments, sort of like, any advice, because obviously I've only just started and I have no clue what I'm doing, so it'd be really appreciated, and yeah, I hope you like the look, and so thank you, bye!